Hey guys, it's Michael with Mealy Marine, and today I'm going to be showing you how to wire a two position switch on your boat. So what you're going to need to wire a two position switch on your boat is you're going to need a power source, which we have a 12 volt battery here. You're going to need some wiring to connect, which we are going to use these test leads. You're obviously going to need a switch. And then lastly is your accessory. In this demonstration, we are going to be using a LED light strip, but this can symbolize anything on your boat, a bilge, aerator, or navigation light. So, the first thing we need to do is we need to ground our accessory. So I'm going to go ahead and take this black lead and we're going to connect it to the negative on the battery and then on a LED light strip, red, white, or yellow is a ground and that just tells which color it will be activated on this LED light strip so we're going to obviously pick red. So we have now grounded our accessory. Next, we need to provide power to the switch from the battery. So we're going to be using this red test lead, connect it to the positive on the battery, and then connect it to the terminal on the switch. It does not matter which terminal you connect it on, but I just connect it always on the middle terminal. Last, we need to complete the circuit by connecting the switch to the accessory. So we're going to be using this yellow lead. We're going to connect to the open terminal and then to the hot wire on our accessory. So now when we flip the switch, we should, as you can see, we have a light. So like I said, just to demonstrate on this particular connector, it does not matter which way around the wires go. All this switch is doing is finishing the circuit, connecting these two leads that are coming in. Well, that's it for this video, guys. I hope you liked it, and I hope it taught you a little bit on how easy it is to wire a simple on-off two-position switch on your boat. If you did learn something or you liked the video, please make sure to smash the thumbs up button and then to also comment and subscribe so that you can learn more about boat wiring in the future. Until next time, guys.